James Comey denies knowing Clinton law firm helped with P. Dossier, I don't remember the name Perkins Coy at all. In what could become a possible issue for James Comey, the former FBI director repeatedly stated in testimony to the House Judiciary Committee that he never knew the author of the infamous anti-Trump dossier had been retained to do his work by a U.S. based law firm. The law firm in question, Perkins Coy, reportedly funded the controversial Fusion GPS to conduct the anti-Trump work on behalf of Hillary Clinton's 2016 presidential campaign and the Democratic National Committee, DNC. Those efforts resulted in the largely discredited dossier written by former British spy Christopher Steele. Despite saying he did not know Steele had been hired by Perkins Coy, the FISA warrant to spy on former Trump campaign adviser Carter Page signed three times by Comey stated the FBI had information that Steele had been hired by a U.S. based law firm. It specifically stated the FBI was approached by an identified U.S. person who indicated to source number one Steele that a U.S. based law firm had hired the identified U.S. person to conduct research regarding candidate number one S ties to Russia. Comey made his remarks during testimony on Friday. Here is a transcript of the relevant portions of Comey's latest testimony as it relates to Perkins Coy. Mr. Gowdy, when did you learn that Fusion GPS was hired by Perkins Coy? Mr. Comey, I never learned that, certainly not while I was director. Mr. Gowdy, well, when did you learn the DNC had hired Perkins Coy? Mr. Comey, I never learned that. Again, while I was director. I think I've read it in the media, but, yeah, even today, I don't know whether it's true. Mr. Gowdy, while you were the director, you never knew that the DNC hired a law firm that hired an APO research firm that hired Christopher Steele? Mr. Comey, no, I don't think so. I don't have any recollection of being told that or reading that or learning that while I was director. Comey was not asked to explain how he could sign three FISA warrants stating that Steele was hired by a U.S. based law firm yet claim not to know Steele was hired by Perkins Coy. Later in the testimony, a skeptical Mark Meadows, 